So this video is going to be my top 5 specialist weapons of Black Ops 3. I've hyped this video up for a while now and um, I just want to let you know don't have high expectations for the clips. I did try hard to go for them but I'm not the best player and some of the videos uh, I had to go into theatre mode to get so they're unsynced so the videos look quite delayed. So uh, keep that in mind but they're, it's not bad quality. Anyway I hope you enjoy and make sure you tell me what are your favourite specialists in the game and whether or not you think they should have, uh, the ones I included should have been different places in the list. Number five, I've got the Scythe, and this one is loved by most people, but I just can't really get into it. Uh, it's pretty good. It's just inconsistent for me. It has a whole load of ammo. Like I said, some people absolutely adore it, but for me, it's just not a great specialist. But every so often, you will get a, a pretty big feed. Uh, I think in one of these clips I end up getting three to four people that were capping a flag so it can be effective if used right I didn't really use this much uh, it didn't take me long to get the clips I think it took me like 10 games to get these couple of clips so it is a pretty good one I just don't enjoy using it I do well with it uh, another reason I don't use it is because oh my god the robot sounds like a goddamn tank while walking you could hear him across the map Number four spot is uh, much loved upon the community, and that's gravity spikes. Now, gravity spikes are like a cheap one to three kills. I mean, look at this, I get them all on a flag. It's great for domination. If someone's capping a flag, you can just quickly run in and completely destroy them. I probably would have put it high on the list, but so many people use them, so many people love them. And then there's a load of people that hate them. But... Again, this is a completely different clip. I just run in and grab it and spike the flag. So yeah, they're fantastic but for getting you one or two kills. But never, I, it's rare for me to get a quad. Superior fucking force. Number three. Now these are coming into my favourites now. And that's the Annihilator. This one is so fun to use, in my opinion, especially on PC, where accuracy is everything. And most people have got pretty good accuracy. I think really all of these clips are triple kills. Unfortunately, I found the hip fire was quite awful, but uh, you don't really get fire in this thing. Basically, every time I pulled it out, I was guaranteed at least two different kills. There's basically no. If you've got a good aim, this thing's just wrecks. I don't think it's too great on console because there's no auto aim, but on PC, there's no auto aim anyway. And as you can see from this clip, it can also take out as Well, I didn't manage to get any clips taken out UAVs, but I took out a hard sentry. And as you can see, this all sweat hit fire. But overall, I think it's a really fun specialist weapon to use. It's one of my favorites. Probably one I'm going to be using for a very long time, or at least until I get gold on. Too. Now this is one of my favourites, and I'm probably going to be using this one loads, is the Ripper. Uh, the enemy team are a lot of my friends because I joined the game and it put them on the other team and they were getting so mad. The, if you're in a room with about four people, you literally have to press the button once and it stab them all. And that's without how frequent you get them. It charges so quick, and if you die like halfway through using it, it'll keep the charge, which is absolutely fantastic. But look at the lunge. It's like Commando from Modern Warfare 2 had babies with, with some steroids. The lunge is out of this world. I mean, surely they must nerf this thing. I was going to put this one at first, but the first one could have just been absolutely annihilated. Now, number one, this is my favourite specialist weapon. 
the purifier. Now, if you haven't used this thing, I'm sure you've came across it, and it is the biggest dick of a thing to come up against. It literally took me two games to get this. It's probably the same people in the kill feed for both games. I got two clips, and they're both pretty long. One, this thing lasts absolutely forever. Literally, it must last for about a minute straight. And it's probably better than most kill streaks. I mean, you can easily get five or six kills with it. You'd have to basically, you can basically one tap people and then burn them death even if they kill you. I'd run around like a headless chicken while I'm using this thing. It's that good. I mean, I got a wraith with it in this clip, I think. Now, as you can see, anyone who challenges me, they're just completely getting obliterated. I think this thing needs to be nerfed, to be honest. I mean, I don't use it much because it's frowned upon a fair bit, but just look at the range. It's ridiculous. I end up getting the wraith here with it. It's the little things. Hardened sentry, ready to deploy. Anyway, thanks for watching. I really enjoyed making this top five, and I'm thinking of making more ones in the future. This one took a, a while because I kind of strayed away from Black Ops for a while since the update came out. But yeah, if you do like it, I'll definitely make some more. Guys, make sure to tell me what to do. If this does well, I'll probably do top five specialist abilities and uh, work harder on getting nicer clips. I know the clips weren't terrible, but they could have been better. Anyway, thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.